हेलो फ्रेंड्स कैसे हैं आप लोग आई होप यू आर डूइंग वेल वेलकम टू माय चैनल जहाजी फंडे सो इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द टाइट्स थियोरेटिकल पार्ट सो गाइस डू सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल लाइक शेयर कमेंट ऑन माय वीडियो और मैंने अपने डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स में अपने चैनल के लिंक डाल दी है सो यू कैन फाइंड मोर वीडियोज़ इन दैट एंड येस ओके चलो फिर लेट गेट स्टार्ट अब टॉपिक टाइट्स तो द टॉपिक इज टाइट्स तो गाइज डू सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल लाइक शेयर कमेंट on my video so let's get started tides the height of the water level above the chart datum that is level of water at the lowest astronomical tide is known as tide tide is formed because of the gravitational pull by the moon as you can see in this diagram one moon is here our moon natural satellite of the earth is here and this is the chart datum chart datum is a reference or you can say that the water level at the lowest astronomical tide so the height of the water level above that chart datum is known as height of the tide and this is caused by the gravitational pull of the moon so basically on the basis of gravitational pull by the moon tides are divided into two part spring tide and neap tide so let us check with the help of the diagram how these tide formed so first is spring tide when the moon is in conjunction and opposition with the sun and earth then the tide formation is known as spring tide so as you can see here this is the opposition and this is the conjunction opposition is basically the angle 180 degree formed at the earth when the sun and the moon both are opposite to each other as you can see in the diagram earth is in the center of the sun and the moon so this is known as opposition and if there is zero degree angle at the earth means moon and the sun lying in the same direction as you can see here so this is known as conjunction as we know tides are formed by the gravitational pull of the moon so here as you can see here this is the highest astronomical tide means the highest utmost highest astronomical tide formed here because of the gravitational pull of the moon and here is the lowest astronomical tide means the lowest to lowest astronomical tide formed here so this is caused by the uh, position conjunction and this is known as the spring tide the difference between the low tide and the high tide will be maximum it means high tide is high as much it can and low tide will be extremely low as much as it can so the difference between the low tide and the high tide will be maximum on the other hand in the neap tide when the moon is in quadrature with the sun and the earth then the tide formation is known as a spring tide uh, sorry neap tide uh, it is neap tide here so as you can see in this diagram quadrature means the angle formed at the earth is 90 degree the angle formed at the earth is 90 degree when the moon and the sun makes an angle of 90 degree at the earth it is known as quadrature so due to the quadrature that highest tide is not as not much high and the lowest tide is not much low so the difference between the two the difference between the low tide and the high tide will not be maximum it means high tide is not so high and low tide is not so low so this is known as the spring tide and the neap tide now on the basis of the rising and falling depth tides are divided into two parts ebb tide and flood tide this you can obtain from the daily pages of the admiralty tide table given for the standard boards now what is ebb tide in any time difference in any time interval if the tide is falling means the height of tide is decreasing then it is known as ebb tide and what is flood tide in any time interval if the tide is rising means the height of the tide is increasing then it is known as flood tide so as you can see this is extracted from the admiralty tide table as you can see in this daily pages suppose i will take the value of 5 at a time of sunday at 0500 hours it is 2 meter that is the height of the tide and that is the standard time so on the left it is given at the standard time and on the right it is given at the height of the tide so at 050 0540 hours the height of tide is 2.0 meter and at 
at 1058 hours the height of tide is 7.5 meters means the height of tide is increasing from 2 to 7.5 meters so this is known as flood tide otherwise from 1058 to 1801 as you can see the height of tide is 7.5 meter earlier and now it is 1.7 meter so now the height of tide is decreasing then it is known as ebb tide so this is the difference between the ebb tide and the flood tide now I am going to introduce Admiralty Tide Table. So there are some important pages for relevant for your exam purpose in the Admiralty Tide Table. So I will introduce them to you. Now, first of all, you have to understand what is standard and secondary port. Standard ports are the major ports whose daily predictions of tides given in the Admiralty Tide Table, that is ATT. It is not possible to take down the daily pages, the daily tidal predictions of each and every port. So the ports whose daily predictions is not given in the admiralty tide table are known as secondary ports. So this is the difference between the standard ports and the secondary port. So the daily predictions of secondary port can be achieved by using their respective standard port. How do we get info about standard port? The info of the standard ports of any admiralty tide table volume, so there are total 8 number of volumes, is given in the index of standard port section. I will show you later in this video. And out of 8 volume, which volume to use is given in the back cover of each volume provided with the world map and also find a chart catalog. Now, standard ports list of admiralty tide table volumes. So as you can see here, this is the index index to standard ports. This page is given at the starting of every tide table as you can find on the first page of the tide table. So this is known as the standard ports and these are the pages where the, <coughs> where the, uh, where the daily predictions of their tides are given. So this is known as index to standard ports. Now daily prediction pages of standard ports. So this is extracted from the ATT. This is known as a daily prediction tables of any any port. Suppose I took the England South Coast Dover. So this time is known as the standard time and this is known as the height of the tide. So these are known as the daily predictions of tide table. So jo maine aapko bataya index mein jo standard ports hai sare to sabke daily pages hote hain exactly aise hi hote hain jaise maine aapko abhi dikhaya hua hai ki yahan pe standard time hota hai aur yahan pe height of tide hota hai. Now, how do we get info about secondary port? The info of the secondary port obtained from the geographical index of any admiralty tide table given in the last pages of each admiralty tide table volume. So, her volume ke piche sabse last mein geographical index hota hai, wahan se aapko standard port ki information milti hai. Secondary ports list of admiralty tide table volume. So this is known as geographical index present in the last of your admiralty tide table. आप यहाँ पे देख सकते हो कि यहाँ पे ये सारे के सारे मैंने given किए हुए हैं और ये सारे के सारे इसके जो हैं ये होते हैं port number. These are known as port numbers. आप यहाँ पे देख रहे हो Adelaide and Air Musi. These are written in the bold letters. So geographical index में जो भी ports bold letter में लिखे होंगे वो सारे standard ports होते हैं और इसके अंदर जो भी जो भी normal letters में लिखे होते हैं जैसे ये लिखे हुए हैं सारे के सारे ये सारे के सारे standard secondary ports हैं तो standard port इसका क्या है Adelaide and secondary port ये सारे secondary ports हैं यहाँ तक Air Musi तक तो as you can see in the diagram Adelaide and Air Musi the standard ports and between them they are, they are the standard they are the secondary ports so there, this you can find from the geographical index present in the last of your ATT. So thanks for watching guys. I hope you learn a lot from this video and I will bring a second session of this video where I can show you how to solve, how to find the height of tide from of the standard ports of the secondary ports. So keep watching and do subscribe my channel, like, share, comment on my video. Bye for the moment. Have a nice day. Take care. Bye.